Hi everyone, I'm Amanda Howell. I'm the business librarian here at UW-Whitewater, and today I'm gonna to give you some tips for citing using Chicago Style. Chicago Style has two main formats. The first format uses footnotes, and the second format uses author date references. This video is going to focus on the author date format. In this video, we'll discuss how to create a reference list as well as in-text citations. There are other videos describing how to cite books, articles, and websites. There are other sources you may need to cite, in which case you should consult the Chicago Manual of Style, available in Anderson Library at the reference desk. It's important that you give credit to others for the work that they've done so you can avoid plagiarism. Not doing so, intentionally or not, is misrepresenting your own work and may result in serious academic and legal ramifications. Once you have all of your citations, you can create your reference list. This list will be at the very end of your paper, and each source will be in alphabetical order. Each reference should have a hanging indent, which means that the first line will be longer than the subsequent lines. The top of your page can say either references or work cited, so double check with your professor as to which he or she would prefer. In addition to citing your sources at the end of your paper, you will also need to cite them throughout your paper. To do this, you will need the author last names, the publication date, and the page number as needed. Notice that when I have multiple authors, I do include all of their names unless I have more than four, in which case I would put ET period AL period after the first author's name. If there is no author, you will use a shortened form of the title of the article or web page in quotes. If you don't have a publication date, as is the case with my website organizational behavior, you're going to put N period D period for no date. This page contains some other useful sources you might want to check out if you get stuck as you're creating your citations. Please feel free to contact me if you have any questions about citing sources using Chicago Style.